Heath Scotland, thank you for joining us on CFC TV. Firstly, what a win, what a gutsy performance. What was the feeling in the rooms like afterwards? Yeah, it was, uh, look, we were pleased with the result. Um, yeah, it started off pretty rough, but um, yeah, we are just happy that uh, we really uh, rolled the sleeves up and, um, and got the result we wanted. We worked together as a team and, and um, yeah, it was, it was a pleasing result that way. I guess it wasn't just the teamwork, it was also the senior players that really showed some leadership on the field. Yeah, look, obviously last week was a pretty uh, rough week for, for everybody involved at Carlton and uh, we were disappointed with their performances. We had uh, done a little bit of soul searching, but it was time for actions and, uh, and you know, enough, of the, enough of the talk. So we, you know, as a leadership group, we wanted to set the, uh, the, the older blokes wanted to set the, lead the way and set the example and, and the younger blokes really lifted. And uh, yeah, like I said, it was a really t uh, even team performance and um, yeah, everyone played a, a big part in the, in the win. Obviously in the first quarter things weren't quite going the Blues way but there were a number of changes that were made. Uh, we saw Jared Waite go to the back line. That's real flexibility that the side has, isn't it? Yeah, look, it's it's a bonus to have players like that that can play either end of the ground, and uh, you know we've got a number of players that can play you know everywhere. Bryce Gibbs uh, is another one that can play you know any any position on the ground, and uh, you know Lockie Henderson can even go back if we need him. So um, yeah, you know, look, that flexibility is important, and some, there's some crucial roles on the weekend with uh, Dennis going to, to Alice as well. We had a big first quarter, and uh, yeah, look, it was it was really nice that uh, we responded after quarter time, and 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 really dug dug in and, and worked pretty hard, and, and were able to turn around the result. We've got a number of young guys that came into the side, people like Tom Bell, Levi Caswell, Nick Graham playing his first game as a senior player. Have you had a chat to some of them? What's the advice that you've given them? Look, we, we just obviously pre-game focus on our, on our structures and making sure from a set-up point of view we're in the right positions. But the boys uh, have showed good form in the reserve, so it's about just telling them to play their, their game that, that's got them into to senior selection. So, you know, Levi, it was great to see Levi really contesting in the air, nice and physical and, and, and holding some marks. Tommy Bell's size and presence in the midfield was uh, was valuable and it was it, it helped turn the, the result from the clearances around for us. And Nicky Graham, he's been killing it since he's uh, he come back from injury. And it was good to see him get an opportunity and, and really you know, get a lot get a bit lot of the football in the short time he, he, um, he was on the field and, and looking forward to seeing his development over the next couple of weeks. And just quickly, you would have experienced a rivalry, rivalry with Essendon for a long time now. Uh, just a word on them, you're expecting another big game, I take it? Oh, definitely. Uh, we are disappointed with the last game we, we played against them. We felt we, uh, we controlled most of that game and, and didn't get the, get the points. But, uh, you know, look, rivalry, it's huge. I, uh, you know, I always coming from Collingwood, the Collingwood-Carlton rivalry was uh, was the biggest pedestrian and Carlton obviously rivals, it's a, it's a huge rivalry and it's a, it's a big uh, big game this week for us in context of the season and uh, um, yeah, we'll be uh, making sure that we bring the same appetite like we did against the Tigers. Well, good luck for this weekend and thanks for your time. Thanks, Lita. Thanks, guys.